Hi, um, I am creating this video because there's a pro constant problem that, you know, customers of New Era are having. And, you know, you see your baseball players on the field, New Era 5950s, you know, they're extremely popular, fashion, you know, performance, all, all kinds of stuff like that. And the biggest problem people have is that they look really weird on some people because of the crown of the hat, which is this part of the hat. Uh, a lot of the time it's way too boxy and, you know, it just doesn't look right. You look ridiculous with it on. It doesn't look like it does on the field. Um, so, let me show you. Like, I just got this hat here. It comes in its box. And I, when I opened it up, I noticed the crown is extremely high up. It's like, and it's like straight up here. So, when I put it on, it's like, it sits really high and it doesn't look right. And... So that didn't look right, but then if you do the method I'm going to show you, you could have this lower crown that looks much better. Or if you repeat multiple times, then you're going to get this much lower where you've pretty much eliminated the crown altogether. So I'm going to show you how we do this method. So this method here requires a paper towel roll and hot water. So if you don't have a sink, you're out of luck. So you don't actually need to fill the sink, you can just have it running and as long as when it gets hot you have to do this right because if you do this wrong the first time the hat could shrink like this hat right here I did incorrectly I didn't use the method right and it got really small to 7 and 3 eighths but it shrunk to like a 7 and 1 eighth so now it doesn't fit anymore so you have to be careful with this um, so first you take the hat you try to get as little of the brim as possible wet and you run the hat under here kind of soaking it and let the water seep through, if you can see that. See how it's coming out of the holes on the bottom? Just kind of let the water seep through. You might want to get all around there. But you're mainly looking to get the crown wet, because that's what we're trying to work on. So you'll do this for about, I don't know, two minutes. Just kind of shaking the water around, getting, the, getting it soft. The reason you don't want to get it on the brim is because the brim is going to get really uh, really soft, not firm. It's not going to stay straight anymore. There are a few different styles to wear New Era hats. And, you know, some people like them curved. Some people like them straight. And if you get too much water on the brim, you can get that curved look, but it's really not going to stay that straight anymore. It's just going to be really flexible. So once you did this, so the hat is really hot because you've been running it through hot water, so be careful. Get that good. See how the hat's really soaked. So, this is where the paper towel comes in. This is pretty much the hardest part. So you're gonna take the roll. You, you're gonna need to make a few layers. The reason you're doing this is so that the hat doesn't shrink. And if, if you do this correctly, then you, you line the inside of it and the hat won't shrink because you'll basically have been stretching, you'll be stretching the crown when you're wearing it. So you don't need this much. You could just Put it on the inside like this, have it sitting in there, and then go all the way around because you don't want it to shrink in the wrong places. And this is going to get really wet, so you're going to need to replace it periodically. And you might want to do a few layers. It's going to fit extremely tight on your head, but it's going to really get the crown. Actually, I don't need this one for this one. So, I have to do is fit this tight over your head and as you can see the crown is stretching and it doesn't look bumpy now because it's dry and as long as you're keeping it like this the hat won't shrink so you wear it until it's dry and then the crown will go away so we'll check back when it's dry alright as you can see the crown completely shrunk you know the bumps that were up here before I'll show you a before picture And this is, you know, me now. It obviously shrunk a lot. And a lot of people say, don't do this. Never put your hat in water. And never get, especially if it's wool. If you use the towel method, it's not going to make this wrinkly. It's not going to shrink the size of the hat. If you do it correct, it'll work. And, you know, it'll come out the way you want. It'll come out fitting better for a lot of people. Some people like the high crown. Some people don't. Um, you know, you can use the shower method, which is where you just wear it in the shower and wear it till it dries on the new MLB hats because they're performance and they, uh, they're polyester so they don't shrink as much as wool. 
Um, but for these hats, you know, you just use this method. It's not going to shrink. It's not going to. It's going to come out pretty well. And as you can see, I curved the brim a little, and it came out the way I wanted. It didn't shrink at all. So I hope you uh, hope this method works for you, and let me know if it does in the comments. And um, so I hope this works. Hope you like the way your hat came out.